stories you've heard. They don't tell the whole truth. The island is indeed a place of legend. There is power and vast riches as well. But many who've sought to claim them have simply vanished without a trace. Your ship is stocked and your crew assembled. Charge your course and your fate. Alright guys, so you saw the trailer, now we're announcing the New World Open Beta. This was actually just released, like I said, at Gamescom. They had this big announcement of an Open Beta. So Open Beta will actually begin on September 9th at 7 a.m. PT and continue until September 12th at 11.59 p.m. PT. Interested players will be able to request access beginning on September 8th at 7 a.m. PT. So definitely take advantage. We're not gonna read, I'm not going to read all through all this, but you definitely can do so yourselves um, just because I want to keep this video short and sweet open beta announced obviously a cool trailer for gamescom uh, a lot of people excited the open beta test will actually be available in english french german italian spanish polish and brazilian portuguese so they ask can i talk and post create content about or stream the open beta yes during the open beta test you are allowed to share record or broadcast beta content and gameplay is the open beta server capacity indicative of launch server so open beta is an important test for our server infrastructure and will feature a higher server capacity than the closed beta but will not represent the full server capacity available at launch players may experience queue times during the open beta test Will my open beta progress will be carried over to launch obviously no their progress will be wiped between open beta and launch what has changed in the new world between closed beta and open beta Patch notes will be available on the official forums. Will I need to download a new version of the new world? Yes, you will need to request access to the open beta client through the Steam playtest tool, uh, Steam playtest tool actually, on the new world Steam page, which is very easy to do. I will have links to the new world Steam page. Also, I will have links, guys, to this article here in the comment section down below, or really in the uh, description down below as well. So we also had the Gamescom opening night live, which featured this uh, this skin right here that you were actually able to uh, acquire if you guys watch for 15 minutes of the broadcast. So just cool things to really talk about today. Obviously, open beta going to be a big deal. A lot of you guys, I'm sure, are very excited about this. Uh, we wanted to kind of give you guys just a quick update. So we'll talk about the patch notes here in a very, very soon to uh, be released video. www.newworld.com Before we go, I want to ask you about uh, post-launch content. Uh, what do you have uh, planned for players after uh, September 28th? Well, we are completely committed to making Eternum a living, breathing world that players will come back to again and again for years to come. So for us, launch is really the beginning. It's day one. We're going to continue to add features well beyond launch, and we're going to continue engaging with the players to help drive our goals and where we take the game. I can't get specific on what we're talking about, but I can give you some hints. Um, players have already been asking for more supernatural elements and more weapons. So we got a pretty cool way to combine those into a deliverable that they'll see shortly after launch. 
And then players have been asking for more group content and expeditions. So we're working toward that as well. And then, you know, with the holidays right around the corner, I'm pretty excited to see what that might look like on a tournament. All right. Thanks so much for joining us, Scott. Thanks, John.